YouTube viewers, Jailbait here with another episode of Master of Orion. We're playing as the Trilarian race, and we just survived our first encounter with the Antarans. Uh, I thought it was going to be an obliteration. We did lose the battle, but not by nearly as badly as I thought we would. Uh, we did quite a bit of damage to them, took out more than half of their fleet, and so I think uh, while we got a black eye, you know, we bloodied their lip. Uh, so, let's uh, continue on. We've got our next colony ship going up to colonize Shamari 2 here. It's a large tundra, and we have the technology to boost it into uh, something better. Uh, the Terran here, we, we haven't colonized um, an actual tundra planet yet. So, now that we have that going, um, with these guys here, they're building this. I think what we'll do is we will get them working on a colony ship of their own. And then maybe this and this, that's fine. And uh, that way we can get their sister planet here, this Tundra world here, colonized as well and upgraded into an Uber ocean biome. Uh, we don't have that, right? Yeah. Okay. So, let's get things underway. Next turn. We're building our third research base on an Antaran ruin site. Once that's done, I guess we'll be able to know how to build the portal to go fight the Antarans. But if it's anything like uh, Master of Orion 2, the Battle of Antares... Uh, their home fleet is going to be ridiculously strong. So, one of the things we may do is build it and send through like a frigate just to see, just to gauge the strength of Antares, and then we'll have a goal to work towards. Um, we don't have to worry too much about Orion in this playthrough because we're not going beams, um, and while the armor might be nice, it's not. Uh, I don't think it's worth going crazy over uh let's go with the fleet needs orders what fleet oh right barnacle here let's move you in here do you need to be upgraded you do new engine and um let's go ahead and head down this way meet up with our colony ship. Wilder Prime has grown. Very nice. I kind of want you guys to finish your colony ship a little faster. Uh, deep space cooling done there. Yeah. So, we got some extra research going on. They are? Here, yeah, what are you guys doing? You're growing. All right. I fathomed new death, Stinger. Uh, mission success. Our... We have infiltrated the Empire. Excellent. Move our things. Uh, the trade treaties are over. We've stolen information revealing all of Bulrathi colonies. You can see they are... Oh, I didn't know that they started with a rich... Homeworld, but heavy gravity. High gravity, high gravity. Oh, they must be used to high gravity. Ultra rich, abundant, rich, ultra poor. Huge ocean. 
Oh man, we want Thrax for. And then they have these really rich planets. Huge, arid, ultra rich. I mean, holy crap. These guys are able to build fleets like nobody's business. So, we may have to worry about them. We've got a spy. We did that. Base factory finished the asteroid up here. Good. Uh, we've got one more asteroid that they can do. However, nope, can't do it there. I'm tempted to come out here and build like a surveillance thing in the Jama. But let's let's build that asteroid base first. All right, spy. So we've done this. It's low. Uh, let's have you. Oh, they have salaries too. Steal their charts, maybe? Let's have you do that. Bravo! We're going to send you at the Sakra. Now, one thing I didn't check on, does that mean that we do not have counter espionage anymore? I don't know. But these guys actually cost money. They have pretty high salaries. So I am not going to build anymore at this time. Uh, all I am going to do, though, is head back to our peeps. We greet you. Hello. We are listening. How would you like to. No. Uh, are you in for a research treaty at this time we decline no okay that's fine and let's go back for a trade we are rejoiced welcome friend what i listen far into history back we've been friended Hello, outsider. Hello. Yes? It is an honor. Walk with the <coughs> wild spirits. Oh, sorry about that. Cough right into the microphone. All right, so we're keeping our relations decent with our friends here. We have some more information on them now because we put a, a spy into their midst, I think. Hello, outsider. Sorry, didn't mean to double click on you. Um, race is not affected by high gravity. And we've got trade treaties going. All right. So, at least for, in this half of the galaxy, we're enriching each other's lives. I'm happy happy to hear, happy to see what I like. We like peace. Peace is good. Um, where is our colony ship at the moment? Our colony ship is... Out distancing us okay uh, in that case I'm gonna have you guys just sit here government support is done there good what do you guys need to do next yes start building on that um, really all you guys need to do is just grow Grow faster. Populate the world. Um, same with you. 
Wilder is populating fast and frequently. And you guys are about to finish your star base up again. Good, good, good. Uh, we do have, oh, we lost a lot of population though. Do that. Arkham Prime has grown. Excellent. Keep growing and start building. Mirror has grown. Good. Keep growing. Uh, Starbase completed. Very nice. After that, go ahead and rebuild your missile base, and then we need to start building ships again. Our military is highly depleted, and after what we've seen with the Bulrathi, I'm scared. <laughs> I'm a little scared. A colony ship has arrived. Beautiful. Colonize this big, lush, beautiful tundra. You know what happens to an ice world when it melts? It becomes an ocean world. <laughs> Look at that. That's lovely. All right, so we'll get the automated factory in the works, and then we will purchase it. Pretty standard. Next turn. Our guy is here, ready to build asteroid lab. Uh, we need production over here. So, now that you've got that. Ocean transformation. 228 turns. Oh my. It's going to be a little while before that happens. So, hmm. I don't know that this is worth it. Because as soon as... we upgrade it, this is like worthless. Then it's just maintenance for no reason. Let's um, let's do our regular kind of start here to start off with. Like a so. And we could actually boost this even more by buying this. That's the nice thing about having good trade treaties and stuff is you can Really jumpstart your colonies quickly. Oh, but because of our thing, we can do this. I forgot about that. Let's do that. I totally forgot about that. All right, you guys are building your colony ship. Good. You're going to grow again in one turn. Good. Good. This is GNN. State of the galaxy. And now the state of the galaxy. Show me population. Current number of colonies. Okay. Oh, Terran. So we have two highly aggressive races. And then the Sakura, which are sort of aggressive. Maybe the Terran are down here. And the Bolrathian Terran will fight it out. Wouldn't that be nice? Uh, so they have grown again. Beautiful. 
continue to grow. Now the joy of this, these guys, is that they can also build a civilian transport and get two population over to this world rather quickly. Will be nice. Um, all right, next. We have stolen Bolrathi charts and we have infiltrated the Sakra. So, Sakra worlds over here we see are happening. Very nice. And here are the charts of the Bolrathi. There's nobody down here. One, two, or two, three. There's two more races, and they're wedged into these tiny amounts of stars right there. I think. Unless just having their charts doesn't show us any races that they've seen. Barasa. Centauri. You like Centauri. Isn't that... Alpha Centauri. Isn't that the Heron homeworld? Draconis. Isn't that the Alarian homeworld? Hmm. I'm almost certain Draconis is the Alarian homeworld. Um. So we've got that. We've got that. Cool. Uh, we'll try to steal the charts from the Sakra. You... I don't know that I want you to do anything. Maybe hit the clack on. Just infiltrate so we can see what they see. They're really close to us, though. Captured spies. Oh. Eighty percent research on this. Okay. Arkham has grown and they finished their research lab. Beautiful. Want this because I want money. And then let's get some star bases being built. We need We need to get some military up defensively. I know the Antarns are gonna attack us again at any moment. Arkham Prime has grown. Oh uh, yeah, we just looked at that. An untold secret has been retrieved from the depths of the abyss. Okay. There it is. The Antaran portal generator. Also, consider this, Stinger. This. I've considered, and I have chosen. All right, what is next? Uh, what did we decide it on? Dev generators, maybe. Cruiser. Oh, Merculite Missile Modification. Yeah, do that. 
Make our missiles a little bit better. The voice of the ancients echoes. Okay. So we can build it. If you build it, it will come. You can build it quite quickly. But, as I said, I doubt we have the ability to fight against them. So, now that we have it, that's fine. But we're not going to do much with it. Colony done. Beauty. Welcome. Welcome to the colony. Uh, make some food while that builds. Marine Barracks is next. I don't know that I like that. I kind of want this star base to be built. And this. Do that. <laughs> Colonies are just sprouting up everywhere. Beautiful. It is beautiful. All right. This is GNN Galactic News Network. Terran and Valerians. Battle against the Valerian Dominion for control of the galaxy. I thought I had seen them. I thought those were, looked like their planets. But yeah, that is most definitely Terran and Valerian. Which means we are all just bunched up. This is like the space over here. Nothing. Uh, Mirror Prime has grown. Oh, wait. Where is that? Right there. And you... Yeah, you're fine. So after that... Go ahead and I guess start working on some of your research stuff. Oh, you're rich. You're my rich world. I'm going to want you that for now you guys are growing at a good tick but I'm gonna want you to grow a lot so that you can start putting people down in there um, We'll go with our standard 
construction base building thing here. And for you guys, I don't need to buy it. Jumpstart your friend, your your colony over there, your sister colony. We've only got two worlds or two systems that we don't have things in. We're going to have this there, and then this will be the only one maybe that pirates can spawn in. So, not bad. Uh, you finished your advanced data center. Very nice. We've got lots of research happening. Um, at this point, you guys need to start building some forces. Here, how do you say spread a little thin? And I want you to grow some more. New ship design. Space factory finished this. Very good. Come out here. Might be able to see the parents if we go up there, but I want to build out some surveillance goobler things. Because we have built everywhere else that we need to. <laughs> Our little space factory did work in this game. An untold secret has been retrieved from the depths of the abyss. Okay. Sure, upgrade all. No. You doesn't matter. I think if we go in here and we save it. So we've got cruisers now. Take a look at these bad boys. So that's kind of an interesting Cyclopean thing. Uh, what does that remind me of? Oh, what are you? Oh, there we go. I like that a lot. This is like a Barracuda. Yeah. Barracuda. Uh, we've got the red theme on somebody else. Let's go. Line B. I kind of flows with the scales. Uh, you too will be a sniper. We've got Merculite Missiles, Laser Cannons. No way, thank you. Uh, we still don't have any specials. But now we've got some cool things to do with our missiles here. Merv. Let's missiles into four warheads. Total damage times two. That's good. Uh, travel speeds. Uh, ECCM is good. Heavy armor. Okay. I think I'm just going to put Merv on. If we had something, uh, eventually we'll get a thing like fast missile racks so they can fire faster. I mean, the 16 second cooldown is oh, absolutely brutal. It looks like we can get nine of these guys on there. Um, with Mervs, which is going to give us a lot of damage. 
double damage. Double damage for double the cost? I thought it was only... Oh, double damage for 50% increase. But the cost is twice as much. That's okay. Um... Again, we kind of want to split these up. Anti-missile rockets, I mean, we can get one of those on there. That's not worth it. I'm just gonna... do this and then when we get mass drivers I'll throw I'll alter it to add in some point defense mass drivers but one rocket is not going to do enough um, so yeah there's our Barracuda now if only I could get the AI to shoot their weapons individually instead of all at once at a single target So, there we go. There's that. Um, speaking of math drivers, I think it's time we grab that. I want this for our rich planet. Cool, but that is going to do it for this episode. We're out of time. We have cons just doing... We've colonized two more planets this, this turn. I can't remember. One turn away from building something. Um... And our tech is increasing quite rapidly. Very nice. Uh, we have to build up our fleet again to uh, resist the Antaran problems. Which means I'd like to get into jump gates as soon as we can. So that we can keep a decent sized fleet in a central location and then go to wherever the Antarans plan to go. I don't know if they always go after your home world or not, but we'll have to find out. But if you enjoyed the episode, tap on that like button. It helps me out and helps out the channel. And if you really enjoyed it, feel free to subscribe for more content. Share it with your friends. Either way, I want to hear from you. So let me hear your comments below, um, or rather read them. Uh, but until next time, I've been Joe Bade. You guys live free, game hard.